Hi, in this video we are going to compare Apple's AirDrop functionality which comes within iOS 7 to Android's NFC file transfer capabilities. In latest iOS 7 if you go to your control center you will see AirDrop. You can tap on it and it has options like you can off the AirDrop or you can set it to contacts only or for everyone. Based on your settings, uh, you can share your content within uh, different different iPads or pods. Currently it doesn't support Mac, so you can't share your contents uh, from your iPod or iPad or iPhone to any of the Mac. The sharing also is very easy, like I have another iPad here, so let me unlock it. You can see that AirDrop content only is active here also. So if I want to share any of my photos, which I can go to the photos and just open a photo and you can tap on share and you have the airdrop where you can see that other device. If you tap on this device, they are going to create a share between through Bluetooth and they are going to transfer this file. If I accept it, they are going to transfer this file via wireless that's why the transfer is very fast so you can see that the file has reached very fast on the iPad I have done a transfer of almost uh, 700 MB of a file also and it's very fast almost a minute and you will see the 700 MB data getting transferred from one device to another the few drawbacks which I have found here is uh, most of your movies and other stuff like your if your in-house videos is not there then um, it's protected by DRM you can't transfer them and um, it's not a, the airdrop functionality is available through only share button so whenever there is an app which allows you to share like uh, let's go to Safari so like here you are seeing um, I am on makeweb.com if I want to share this, I can just tap on it and in the airdrop, I can share with the people instantly like the iPad and this is again going to pop up here if you accept, it's going to open a browser and it's going to show you the same contents as this here so you can see that sharing is very easy you don't have to do anything just share share through airdrop and select whomsoever you want to send the content and the content will be available right away onto the other device so you can see how easy it is to use airdrop now we are going to see how the nfc works on android speed wise not much of a difference because both of them uses um, wireless ad hoc wireless networks to transfer the files so you can go on to any gallery your gallery or any content wherever you have the content uh, supposedly I have this picture if I want to transfer it to my other device just have to unlock it and bring both the device closer so you can see that it's asking me for touch to beam once you touch it it's going to prepare the contents and share with each other now this has taken little bit more time if you see but it's because this file is almost around 6 MB and the other file when we did for I, um, iOS was around 2 MB but the data transfer is almost equivalent speed with wireless and it's easy to transfer the files from here to there the benefit from NFC is that NFC allows you NFC allows you to not only share the files content you can almost use any level of content let's, so let's see that um, if I open my make web world on one of the device and can attach both the device together if I tap on it it's going to open the make web it's going to open the make web world on the second device also where you can browse through the contents 
so um, the features are almost same they both use uh, Wi-Fi it's just that to enable the connection Android phones are using NFC's and to, they are using Bluetooth to enable that particular connect to start getting the transfer done NFC is much more capable than just the file transfer and uh, that's we all know you can make payments you can use NFC tags to initiate certain some actions uh, chain settings and a lot of other things which is still missing from iOS implementation of this they have only covered the file transfer piece but the only thing which I can say is um, touching two devices and transferring data looks much more eye-catching than just uh, sharing it through airdrop but speed wise and uh, there is not much of a difference you can't uh, differentiate much between those two so hope this video will help you how to use NFC's versus I Apple's airdrop you can subscribe to make web world YouTube channel for more uh, videos on the tech side thanks